Well, college students today have a lot to deal with. There are more graduates and fewer jobs, so keeping up with their course requirements is perhaps more stressful today than ever. Uh, fortunately, there are courses in the art department designed to teach and also lower stress at the same time. And Charlie takes us to Fulton Hall in tonight's travels. Fulton Hall at Salisbury University, home to Ted Nichols' famous World Drum Ensemble, is also home to a wonderful ceramic studio down the hall. Thank you. It's a place with a little less stress. These kids are just stressed with all the work they have to do and everything. With my students, we create kind of a, a pleasant place to be. So that way you can do your work, frankly. I'm an environmental studies major. Mm -hmm. um, medical lab science. We have the clear glaze today, right in here. That's it. Yay. It's easy to imagine the relief they feel when they go from a lecture to a potter's wheel. Clay is the original medium. I um, worked in stone and wood, and I've painted. But clay just keeps, I don't know, grabbing me. Over there with the other raku glazes. Yeah. It grabs her students, too. Like, there's nothing better than a teacher that's nice, hands-on, that knows what they're doing, that, like, really is, like, more, like, enthusiastic. And every time, like, I come into class, she has a smile on her face, and she's, like, she's ready to help me. Now Karen's an adjunct professor, which sounds pretty highfalutin, but... It really isn't. The one beauty about being adjunct is you don't have to go to any meetings. You're invited. That's almost worth it right there. Isn't it? Adjunct literally means it's something that is not essential. But for these young folks, these hours are essential. Oh man, she's working so hard. <laughs> Look what she's making. Yeah, like beautiful. she's creating. That didn't exist before. He gets into it and that makes us get into it. You get more stuff out of it. At Salisbury University, it's Charles Paparella for WBOC News.